What up fam, what up family? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Bismatic and I'm back with another one for y'all. This time around, this time around we got Blondie with Call Me. All right, now of course I got the lyrics. Look, you gotta have the lyrics. You, you, just, you just have to. All right, now if y'all wanna see more Blondie on this channel, y'all let me know what's next in the comment section below. All right, let's go ahead and watch. Wow, uh, cool little song. Um, what I noticed about Blondie is that they know how to write a good song, and their production is almost is always on point. People don't understand. You know what's crazy? <clears throat> As somebody who writes, right? People don't understand how hard it is <laughs> to write a bubblegum song, right? Like this is not bubblegum. This is like it, 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 it's a cool little song. Love the production, but let me get back to my point. People don't understand how hard it is to write a a, a bubblegum song, right? People usually call bubblegums bubblegum songs are very poppy, you know. Uh, it, it, it's kind of like an air bug, you know. It's good, it, like it's very bright, 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 bright. People don't know how hard it is to write those songs, right? It's kind of like writing a jingle. Writing a jingle is so hard because the sole purpose of writing a jingle is for it to get stuck in your head. It's for you to remember it. It's for you to be in your kitchen, minding your business, about to um, fix up a plate of spaghetti, and then you hear, call 1877 in your head, not even on the radio. You're like, what the fuck? This shit ruined your meatballs. Pause. But that, that that's what it's like. So writing a great song and writing a poppy song is way more difficult than writing a, a song that people will consider to be intriguing and blah, 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 blah. Because when you're doing exactly what you want and when you're doing something that's designed to make people go crazy, it's two different things. When you're doing something that you want, you know, it, it, it might not necessarily sound great to everybody. But here's the thing. Pop songs... You may hate it, but it sounds good. Like it, it, you know, it, it's it, it's uh it, it sounds good. It's not a subjective thing, you know. It's objective. It, it sounds good, you know. Majority of the uh, senses would be like, this is a good sounding song, but it's not my type of shit, right? 
I said all that to say this. That's the importance of uh, of Blondie because they know how to craft a good song. Uh, uh, the lead singer, I always forget her name. Um, I, she's not necessarily a great singer, you know, but it, the songs that they write for her, it just fits her, like this song fits her vocals perfectly. Like you can't even necessarily really hear the imperfections in, in her vocals and, and that, that, that high tone, annoying pitch that she usually do. It's not even here. I, I guess it is here when she don't, but the melody with it is so perfect that it doesn't really bother you that much. So, yeah. Great song, man. Great song. Amazing songwriting. Amazing production, as always. Uh, dope song. Oh, it, it ain't going on my playlist. Uh, but definitely a dope song by Blondie. I, 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 I approve. <laughs> and I approve. Had a lot of coffee, so... Y'all let me know how you feel about this song in the comment section below. Also, let me know what is next from Blondie in the comment section below. And if you made it this far, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. Join the squad. We'll be glad to have you. We have plenty of seats. You know what I'm saying? Sit down. Sit, sit, sure. We have plenty of seats available. <laughs> Anywhere. All right? And <clears throat> subscribe. Share with a friend. Right? Uh, uh, I'll see y'all in the next one and guess what you have got to better be there peace